Hello guys, I'm Nook and I came back to explain you I'm doing some, I had find the time to do some research on the, the types of uh, ground cells so I did, I have a schematic here too so we're going from left to right so number one this short is a cooper pipe I wrote down here I don't know do you see it's here and it's a long piece of iron road shaft in the middle so it's almost around maybe uh, one quarter inch space and the second is um, this one it's short here like inch and a half cooper pipe in a long road but exactly the measurement thickness I don't know because uh, after this I will take all this to the scale and we're gonna I'm trying to measure it in weights so why I do that I will explain you after so number three is this one big road big iron road they are the same size like a Cooper here Cooper is the same like a road and uh, it's also thickness of this iron road, same like the first one. So, but just it's the same size, like a Cooper pipe. On fourth one is a tiny, tiny uh, road, and uh, but they are the same size, like a Cooper pipe. So I will show you what I'm getting now: voltage and amperage, and we're gonna calculate in watts. So. <clears throat> I have a jumping here around on, on the amps, but I will try to, to, to measure just on when it stays a little bit stable on amps. So I just put down here that stable time. I, on this here, we have voltage first, one second, third, fourth. On this side is amperage of all of them. So here's the result of wattage. And uh, also this here is the wattage on the top. You will see that the top, uh, the, the, the highest it hits on the uh, meter. So it's not a stable, it's just when it hits to the, 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 uh, the highest we can get. So let me go try with that voltage first. I set up on 20 <coughs> DC voltage. So let's go first one. First one is one o two voltage. Okay. Second one is ninety one. Third one. 89 okay and fourth one is 0.62 okay now let's go on amperage I'm gonna switch over here on DC amperage on 20 milliamps so let's hit first one I hope you're gonna see this it hits on 1.8, sometimes on 2. See, 120. And I put down here 106, but it hits almost on, sometimes on, on 2. But and, and I calculate voltage times amperage 106. I can use here 106 amperage. So I calculate it counts. 0 0.0010 10 watts but uh, uh, after when I I was getting the highest here look now I'm getting more than 177 but 177 milliamps I was calculating with the watts 101 I'm getting 0 0.017 watts this one so let me go on this one with amperage second was 
now it's 37, it was 43 before, stable. Probably I need a better connection and my roads are nasty, dirty, or dirt maybe. But anyway, like 37. Try it again. I should get more, but on he, this one I was measuring uh, 0.43 milliamps. The top I was getting 0.56. So this one was voltage 0.94 times 0.43 is 0.304 watts. So, but on the highest jumping amperage I was getting same I mean just a one more up 0 0.30 and what five watts so let's go on third one on third one the reading was voltage voltage 0.87 let's see now 89 Let's say 87. Let's go up on milliamps. So 157. I hit, but uh, let's go and find the stable when it stops jumping. My God. 75 starts running down. You know when it starts to going down after let's say it was 75 then 74 3 4 when it's jumping around then you can see 70 70 how much i put it on it's third one i put on 0.61 milliamps but i get more 74 i think now but let's say it's 61 and 0.87 times 61 is 0.305 watts but when I had a jumping on 1.5 see I got before the jumping on uh, probably is losing I need to wait a little bit like a charge to get the charge or just a connection See, you gotta wait a little bit and I'm getting more amperage so <clears throat> on the third one I was measuring a, a point, uh, 0 0.87 watt volt times 1.550 milliamps it's 0 0.0013 watts and on fourth one voltage is 56.61 okay I was putting here 58 but here's the 58 times let's go Amperage 53 51 51 was stable. I was putting here 53. Okay, close enough. No, 50. 50. This is the top, the highest it jumps, but 50. So 58 times 50. I mean, point fifty-eight times point fifty is a point zero 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 three watts. So it's almost the same when it jumps on fifty-three. You're getting the higher jump. You're getting the same three zeros and three watts. So from all of these, we can see that iron road. The bigger we're getting more amperage but one thing is different here which i was trying to explain i was using the number two and number four just them two so here's a little bit a little bit um, 
thicker roll than this one but this pipe is twice as bigger than this so the weight of this Cooper little pipe and the road are the same and the weight of these two are not even close so the Cooper is 1.6 here Cooper pipe grams and the iron road is like 